Well, this is three hours later. There is nothing on this wall. Not even the pegboards. So I could scoot this back. She's still going to keep this in here to, to kick back or whatever. I took all the DVDs out. All the other boxes are full of figures and different things. Uh, so they're gone from over there. I still got the VHS and stuff to go through. And I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to put that over here with the other movies. I ain't touched this yet. Uh, but yeah, this is it. This is... I took all the Blu-rays from the top shelf and moved them to the very top shelf and put some uh, big case, uh, big uh, box sets on the end to hold them. I took all the pictures and stuff down. So it's just going to be the movies left in here with uh, Rousey stuff when uh, I get the rest of it out. Uh, but I did have to leave some room to grow in case my dumbass wants to buy more movies when i've got <laughs> i don't even have as much as most people do but i don't i left this little shelf over here i stacked all this on top of here so you know these are all alphabetical order these are these start with my godzillas all my godzilla movies and then into a or the numbers a and so on and so on all the way down to right up here where it starts with the l's and moves all down to the o's and so and so which i had to stack them because that was going to end up being full. I could just tell it ahead of time. So I could make room here. Maybe one day I'll probably have to stack these here. But there is a lot of people out there that has a hell of a lot more than I do. Um, but count my VHS. I've got a, like 1100 some movies. And I don't really have a whole lot of VHS. I got some down here. Not much. And of course these are pretty much full. I think I got a few that's not got a whole lot in it. So I can't even remember. I've got it on my app exactly how many VHS I got. Um, I know I got like, I think, I got more DVDs than anything. I think I've got close to 600. And I've got around five maybe on Blu-rays, 500, somewhere, something like that. But this is uh, three hours later. And after taking a, all that other stuff to the shed... And packing up even more stuff to take to the shed. So, yeah, Rosie's going to have this. Uh, and she's, I'm going to leave this eventually. And she's going to have her desk here or somewhere. But I'm going to keep these. Uh, she's going to keep the bookshelves. I'm going to find something else to put these on. All this stuff's going to be. I'm going to get a display here soon. Um, glass display. I might actually get two. One for my car stuff and one for my vintage figures and stuff. Um, off of my buddy Ralph that uh runs the uh diecast shop so yeah that'll take care of a lot of that and if not i might make some shelves to put on the other stuff on and everything but yeah it's all bare over here it's really weird looking and it does look weird to stack movies like that but i ain't got no choice right now i could put them in and it would just take up the rest of the room and i don't really want to do that because every once in a while i buy a new movie i just got this one in the mail um, a few days ago, Thanksgiving, I haven't watched it yet. Uh, here it's pretty good, but uh, yeah, it's the only movie besides the few that I bought at um, McKay's a few videos ago. I think I bought four there, so I bought five movies in the last two months because of this shit right here. I just don't have a whole lot of room. If the shed had air and heat all the time, I really wouldn't worry about taking these up there, but it's not. It's just going to be when I'm there and stuff. So uh, I don't want to ruin over a thousand movies. I don't know how long, how much heat DVDs can take or, or Blu-rays or the cold. I don't know. So, uh, yeah, I just don't want to chance that. I know my records and stuff's going to have to stay here too. And I'm not even sure about the damn stereo. It's a, it's a mess, but I'm, I'm cleaning up slowly, but surely. And uh, that is the second video of this process. Um, yeah, tell me what you think. That's it for this video. Um, this is Movie John, and I'm always filming.